Across Lake Chad, thousands of people are making a desperate bid for freedom. Crammed aboard this boat are 86 men, women and children who fled for their lives when militants attacked their village in northern Nigeria. Shocked, they arrive in Chad on the eastern shore of the lake with the only possessions they can carry. Behind them, armed militants have left a trail of destruction. Hassana Mahamadu left her five sons behind when her village came under attack. She escaped with her daughter, Hajara, but the eight-year-old was shot in the arm during the mayhem. Her arm was amputated on her arrival in Chad. More than 17,000 people fled the worsening violence and made their way to Chad in January. At the Dar es Salaam refugee camp outside Bagasola, WFP is distributing high-energy biscuits and other food assistance. There are many challenges ahead. Chad already has one of the highest rates of chronic malnutrition in the world, and amid fears that the influx of refugees is going to rise, WFP is stepping up operations in a bid to feed the thousands. 